What's rockin' DSA? I'm Roxy the Rockstar. Today's Rocktober 21st. Let's rock out to the pledge. Have you met my pet rock Brock? Oh yeah, and his annoying little sister Pebbles. She's always hungry. Hey, hey, Brock. Hey, hey, Brock. Go ahead, Pebbles. When's lunch? I'm hungry. Come on, it's like 8.30 in the morning. But what's for lunch? Today's lunch is... Pizza, yogurt snacker, chef salad green beans, Popeye salad with ranch dressing, and applesauce. I want food now. Not now, Pebbles. But Brock. No. But Brock. Pebbles. Please. No. You know what they need to do? Synergize. That's habit number six. The seven habits are really great life lessons. Let's take a closer look on habit number three. Put first things first. Do you find yourself running out of time? You need to remember a simple little habit. Put first things first. This jar represents your time, your life. The sand represents things in your life that don't have a lot of importance. The small rocks represent things that are sort of important but have consequences if you don't do them. Then there are the small stones in your life. Things like hobbies, your job, or even spending time with people in relationships that are not good for you. Notice again, you're running out of room very quickly. Now, if you put in your big rocks last, things like family, friends, your education, health, goals, volunteering to help others, or working for a cause, you can see that there's no room. Let's try something different this time. If you fill your life with big rocks first, you'll see that things turn out very differently. You may have to rearrange a few things, but you'll notice things are beginning to fit. You may even find that there's time left over to do anything you choose. The sand, all the things in life that have no importance, can also fit. Think about your days and all that you really want to fill them with. Then, make the changes that are needed to make you a really happy and successful person. Welcome to Educational Bake Shop with Bailey and Marissa. Here at Educational Bake Shop, we love to bake new sweets, especially cupcakes. We've recently created some new types of cupcakes based on the three main types of rocks. And let me tell you, these cupcakes, they rock. Let me go get the cupcakes. This is the igneous cupcake. Don't you lava at this cupcake? I want to say that pun doesn't make sense, but it does. Because igneous rocks are commonly called lava rocks. They form when the lava cools. They also commonly have a glassy surface, which is why we added glaze to the frosting. Bubbles sometimes form inside these rocks. That's why we added holes to our cupcake. Meet the metamorphic cupcake. Have you ever met a morphic cupcake before? You need to change your puns, like a metamorphic rock. These rocks go through changes because of heat and also because of pressure. These rocks commonly have crystals on them because they form underground. They form very slowly and over time. Can you guess what the next rock cupcake is? It's sedimentary, my dear Marissa. We added sand-like sprinkles on top of the cupcake because sedimentary rocks are often formed from sand, pebbles, shells, and other debris. They'll eventually crumble and look like this. These rocks always have layers. Well, we need to get decorating these cupcakes. Now back to Kayla and Allie. That was some rockin' stuff. We should all have goals in life. You know, know our destination before we begin our journey? My goal is to become the number one rock star in the entire world. What's yours? That's a great question, Roxy, and since all questions have an answer, here it is. Arius, what are your goals for the future? Be an Edifel and graduate from college and get a scholarship. Will, what are your goals for the future? I want to be a professional soccer player and a movie director. What are your goals for the future, Alyssa? I want to get into a good college. And Emily, what are your goals for the future? To be a professional performer and to go to a good college. DSA students have some pretty rockin' goals. I've been chatting with Pebbles, and she's a big gossip. We were talking about DSA's rock walk Let's take a little trip back in time. Congratulations, rock walk class winners. First place goes to Miss Rodriguez. Her class raised $919. Second place goes to Miss Fowler with $785. Third place winner is Miss Leonard with $738. 
You guys will be having an ice cream party. Fourth place is the middle school class, Mrs. Kurowski. It looks like you will be getting donuts. Save me one. And fifth place goes to pre-K, Mrs. Fryer with $657. OMG, have you heard the Erosion Brothers' new hit single, Rock? Their classic rock songs are crater than anything I've ever heard. Rocks, 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 rocks. Sedimentary. Avalanche. Igneous. Metamorphic. Boulder. Rocks, 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 rocks. rocks, 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 rocks. rocks. What I tell you, best rock band in this century. Well, DSA, I hope you have a rockin' day.